<coughs> well, I've been out there watching. Seeing the happening, what's happening, what's happening, what ain't. What is, what is, what ain't, what ain't. And I was watching. I've been wanting to see the girls. I ain't saw the uh, sardine smelling ass since Funkbox been locked up. With that tweet, 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 tweet. Whatever the fuck they say. And I finally saw Malia today. Malia, you crazy. I ain't telling you to go home. I tell you to stay your head right there. If y'all come over here and thinking, uh, I'm gonna be all sympathetic and talking all nice about they funk head, you got the wrong place. Okay, so okay. Cause it ain't happening over here. Not over chill. That ain't happening. Uh-uh. Stay your dumb ass over there. The man in jail. The man didn't get a bun the other day when they went to court Friday. Didn't get a bun. They locked his ass back up. That man is mentally really rigid. No kid told me I can't say that. <laughs> Gotta dress it up now. I can't say that, but you know what you know what that is. That man got a deficiency. And y'all got a motherfucking deficiency to still be sitting there listening to that bullshit that he's spurring out. And true your ugly bone face that you look like a uh, skeleton, skeletal looking ass. Y'all trying to save it. Y'all trying to save save the empire. Y'all try y'all think that's an empire. Y'all trying to save the empire. But go right ahead on child. Do what you do. Mm-hmm. But I was listening to Malia talk. I said, you know what? She already don't talk that damn good anyway. And I love to hear, uh, I love to hear, uh, the Louisiana, uh, people talk. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Uh, my word, my favorite word, probably everybody else's word, uh, favorite word for them to say is baby. I don't even want to hear her saying that. She don't talk with for shit. I love to hear Velvet talk. I love to hear Miss Wanda talk. I love to hear Nolan's girl talk. And I love to hear Peanut Noel talk. But you, my funk about tuna fish, you sound just like that, a damn tuna talking. Girl, I was like, listen to this. I know I talk bad and I talk fast, but you be putting words the motherfucking together and be and uh you know you know and trying to think of what to say next. You don't know simple motherfucking words. You get on this fruit box motherfucking cake cake cake. You don't know. What to say? You don't know if you're going to say the right thing or the wrong thing. What's the wrong thing? The wrong thing. You don't do it in the right way. Y'all don't know nothing about that. <laughs> you. You talk stupid. <laughs> Shit, ain't no other way for me to say it. Hey, you talk stupid. Stupid. Stupid is, stupid does. <laughs> Girl, I was like, I've been wanting to hear her talk. You got on my. Girl, you got on my motherfucking nerves. You drove my motherfucking nerves bad. 
you made the motherfucking store uh shift shaking and I got them there was shocked. Uh, I got them there went in cardiac arrest. I was like, uh uh-uh, uh uh-uh, I got to go. I can't listen to no motherfucking mo. <laughs> I got to go. And true, you the same motherfucking way. You stupid. Ain't no other way for me to say it. Hell. You don't fuck them up. They stupid. I just sit back and I look at their ass and I laugh. I don't try to come up with no solution for them or try to help them. Fuck them. No, I'm just being honest. I don't give a damn. I told y'all this ain't the channel. If you think you're going to come over here and hear me say some positive things about them, this ain't the place for the, uh, over. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, baby. <laughs> no, 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 baby. I'm going to talk about the ass. All of them ass. Whether it be true, false, made up, what the fuck ever. I say what the fuck I want to say over to him. Boy, you sound stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Forrest Gump sound like he got better, had better damn sense than you did. And that was just a TV show. True, who I'm talking about. Then Caliber get his old black ass on him. Looking like a toy baby. Touching all on his nose and shit while he talking. He couldn't talk for study rubbing on the goddamn nose. And I ain't see shit he was, he was rubbing. Then they got another one got on here I saw. Juju, he uh, that age there. Caliber, well all of them age except for True True too old. But them the young folks right there. Gonna make this thing difficult. Difficult and different. It ain't no more that era where I come from, which I come from in the 60s. Ain't no more that. Mm -mm. It might be some 70 and 80. Cause their mom and daddy probably was, you know, old school. But this new school, I don't fool with the new school. I don't fool with that new school shit. Can't tell them shit. They know everything. They think you're old. You talk too much. Old lady, y'all won't call problems. Why you old B out here causing problems? I stay in my motherfucking life. I don't cause no problem that ain't been given to me. I sit here and I look like everybody else and come back over here, get my opinion. I don't go in no chat. Every once in a while I might go into a, a, like a replay and do a comment. I might. Every once in a while. I quit doing that because I was doing that for a while. Very seldom I do that in somebody. And somebody come in. But I don't fuck with them young people. Mm -mm. No. Uh-uh. And my kids know better than to talk to grown people. Like how some of these young folk talk to uh the uh older uh older generation. Let me say that. I wish the fuck they would. Y'all may think I'm playing when I say that, but I will karate judo chop your motherfucking ass in the neck. Unless they getting out of line with you. Now, if they getting out of line with you, then, you, yeah, but just straight up just disrespecting a, a, a grown-up, I wish the fuck they would. Because if you disrespect them, you will disrespect me. And if you try to disrespect me, I'm the one who brought you in this motherfucker, and I'm going to judo chop your ass in the goddamn neck and take you out this bitch, okay? We finna fight. <laughs> Mama ain't never had to fight you, but I will if I have to. 
But this new generation, she they'll fight those goddamn mamas and, and whoop their ass. Them per the parent now they friend. Them became the kids friend. It's all right to be friend, but there's a line you cross. And when they cross that line with you, they'll cross that line with another elder that's trying to tell them some uh, right information, but they don't want to hear the right information. They so motherfucking throw left that it's going to take forever and ever and ever to bring their motherfucking ass back right. You hear me? Yeah, I got this on because... Uh, Friday night, I got sick with Santa, Santa, Santa. This damn Santa's been, busy. I mean, been tearing my ass up, been fucking me off the motherfucking bone. Um, and I had to go through the emergency and get some uh, medication for my sinuses. But I'm okay. And then let me tell you, say this while I'm on there. The test results that I was waiting on, one came back, and it wasn't as bad as I thought it was. Um, she gave me a four month. Um, promissory note <laughs> to come back in four months. So, uh, some of my results uh, had went up. So, I wear it for nothing. I gotta stop that. And I'm trying to get better at that, especially with this next test that's coming up. I'm trying not to worry about it as much because I was stressing about both of them. That's why I hadn't been on here. And every once in a while, I stick my head in and then I, you know, duck out. Because I'm like, I'm trying to concentrate on this. Like, what the fuck is going on, man? <laughs> Come on, man. What's going on? Let's get this shit together. So me and my son have talked to me. He's like, you can't do nothing about it if it is. But you can. If it's something wrong, then we're going to get some medication. And we're going to take the medication. And if that's going to fix it, we're going to get it fixed. So I ain't no need to just worry about it. And if it was bad as you thought it was, they would already have said that. But they didn't say that. And when I went back and the lady did, she said, it ain't as bad as... So I'm like, okay. So now I'm waiting on one other test result to come back. Ain't heard nothing back from them. Okay. But yeah, the young folks. I don't fuck with the young folks. I will not go out my house to the store after 3 o'clock. Because that's when they get out of school. And they be up here fucking up the goddamn stuff. No. Um, no. If I got to wait till about 7, 8 o'clock to go to the store, I will do that. Unless I go in the morning. And if I get, forget something, I got to go back in there. It's going to be way over in the motherfucking evening before I go back up there. I'm not dealing with they ass. Because I already know how my shit up here is set up. That I've been cussing one of them little motherfuckers out. And then they're going to cause a whole another bad problem for me. <laughs> No. But yeah, true. Talk silly. Malia. Talk silly. All of y'all talk. I heard Efru. Efru. Don't talk no more. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. You same way. You don't know what the fuck to say. I ain't heard old poor Nick and uh, Aya say nothing looking like an anaconda. And I ain't heard what that little wood name was her. She young, too. She that generation that uh I don't fuck with at all. Don't even say hi to her motherfucking ass. She that generation. That Zoka with her whole young ass. All she want to do is fight and be ready. <laughs> girl, back in the day, you girl... I know some, girl, I know some people that, <laughs> I know some people, as soon as you hoop, and they, the girl, they make you, your ass holler. As soon as you hoop, they'll make your ass motherfucking holler. Some old crows. <laughs> girl, I don't fool with them. But I just wanted to stick my head in and say, Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers around. If you're a good mom and you're taking care of your babies, you're doing what you have to do. Happy Mother's Day to you. Because I'm going to tell you, I was a single parent. Might as well have been a single parent. I had first, kids first hood. My first husband was a kid daddy. He didn't do me. Uh, 
What the Mr. Man and Mr. Marquis? Uh, he did me some bad. <laughs> he did. After I didn't get back with him, he did me bad with the kids. When help, when do I had to do what I had to do? I had to work. How many jobs I had to work? You go for it. If I had to change the goddamn tire, I would learn how to change that motherfucking tire. Do you hear me? But I'm thank, thank you. I didn't have to uh, go that far, okay? But I have had some jobs. So to you mothers out there, that's got to do what you got to do. Then I had another one. Wanted me to uh, go to school, make something out of myself. Hell, I made something out of myself. Hell, I made two babies out of my damn self. I might not be the job you want me to have, but I'm working. Gee, I'm working. And if I felt like if I went back to school, and that would be going to require me to go to school at night. So they were going to be at home at night because he was going to school. So we're going to be in school. They're going to be in my house at night with me not there. Not I said kid. <laughs> Not I said direct. <laughs> uh -uh. Uh -uh. You understand it? If I want there, you want to stand at the house unless I'm going to the store or something. While I'm at damn school trying to get a damn education. You gonna have Pauline, Cynthia, Linda, and Brenda in my goddamn house. Maybe John, Billy, and Bob. Because I got a boy and a girl. Uh-uh. I won't stay at this murder fur fur so I can see what the fur fur going on around this ridge. <laughs> I got to see what's going on around this ridge. I got to see who come in out this mother fur girl. You hear me? No. <laughs> uh-uh. So if you want them kind of mama, Happy Mother's Day to you. Cause I was that bitch. I was a whole bunch of bitch. <laughs> when I wanted to be and when I needed to be. But anyway, Happy Mother's Day. It's pretty here in Texas. Sun shining. My yard need cut. All my uh, rose bush. I planted a pink uh, breast cancer rose bush. Oh, this year it gave me so many beautiful flowers. I thought I was going to get to uh, take me a picture, but by the time I got up and got well, uh, the blooms had fell off. I was like, ah. So I'm hoping that it rebloom again. And the one that I planted in the back of my mama was a rose bush because she liked roses. Uh, it didn't give me the one rose I see out there. I looked out the fruit and scope. But uh, it's nice here. It's pretty. Sun is shining. I'm finna, um, I made me some barbecue ribs and some smothered potatoes with some onions, yeah. And I'm finna go in here and fix me a plate. I'll fix one plate. I'm finna fix another plate and another and another. Because I lost some weight. Let me talk about that for a while. You know I like my weight. But I lost some weight. Because I like thick, thick. But I ain't thick, thick. But I'm working on them. Got sick this time. Sick this time. And wasn't eating. That, that's my problem. When I get sick, I, I, I tend to not eat enough. So I got to work on that. But uh, I was feeling kind of self-conscious about it. But now, boy, poo. <laughs> Boy poo. <laughs> mm. <laughs> when she cleans up, she cleans up. <laughs> yes. But I'ma get off of him. And I'ma go enjoy the rest of my Sunday. You guys do the same. <coughs> Damn, I won't got choked on my own. Oh shit. <laughs> you guys do the same. Happy Mother's Day to you. And I want to tell my beautiful, wonderful daughter. 
happy birthday. This was the best Mother's Day birthday that I could get for years. All through, and still getting them. Cause when I first had, I said, "Oh, I had a real Mother's Day. I had a real Mother's Day. Oh, it was the perfect time." And I wanted a girl too, so I got my wish. And today is her birthday, and I want to say to her, "Happy birthday!" All right, y'all. I'm gonna get off of him. I'm gonna do it a little deep, the deep, the deep.